this week on the reels, I don't know what week it's, I'm not even going to embarrass myself. But I'm reviewing the 2011 film that's just come out. Uh, I don't know when it came out in the US, but it just came out in the UK last week. Uh, Colombiana. This stars, I've just got the uh, things up here, so I'm just going to tell you who stars in. I've just got the uh, IMDb page. Zoe Soldana, probably best known her from uh, Avatar. She uh, voiced one of the blue creatures, I can't remember the names. Uh, Jordi Malar, Lenny James. Uh, who's a great UK actor, by the way, Cliff Curtis, uh, and Callum Blue. So uh, what this film basically about, it's about a young girl, Catalana, who's named after like it's like a uh, Colombian flower. And her dad's like a uh, it's kind of like a gangster in uh, Colombia. And when she's younger, she witnesses her parents both get killed in uh, like right in front of her. And uh, but her father's like kind of he's not taught to like to be an assassin or anything. She's just uh, quite good, and she manages to escape and uh, flees to New York, uh, to New York, to uh, Chicago, to uh, live with her uncle and uh, grandma. When she's there, obviously she's witnessed a bad thing, and she wants a bad. She asks her uncle when she grows up, she don't want to be nothing normal that she wants to do because she was quite clever at school. She just wants to be like. Uh, a killer basically so and then it fast forward to like 15 years later from 1992 where the like beginning sequence was set and uh it shows her she like gets arrested and like the first kind of this is like the first kind of scene you can you see her in she gets arrested and you see it's quite clever how she's done it she's she goes to a uh to the prison where she knows one of like a colombian the gangster who had something to do with her father's death whatever her father's death is and the way she gets like in there and kills him is just brilliant. Uh, you can definitely tell some of these like uh, scenes, like fight scenes where she's she's going around and sneaking around the water. Uh, the screenplay of this is by Luc Besson, so you can actually do uh, directed Leon, I think. I don't know if he directed or just wrote it, but you can definitely feel like some of these scenes are definitely as good as like the Leon fight scenes, they're just brilliant. So, uh and then you find out after that that she is like uh, doing like kind of hit hit jobs like assassins for her uncle. Her uncle's like finding these people who are obviously Colombian gangsters or whatever and they're doing stuff to uh, like the family or friends and doing bad stuff. So uh, she goes around and does that. But in the end she's just like eventually looking for one person, the person who actually did it. But... Uh, yeah, there's some there's some really brilliant, clever scenes in this. Uh, Zoe Saldana, it's just awesome in this. Like I say, I only really saw her in, well, didn't even see her, heard her in Avatar and thought she was great in that. Uh, but yeah, she's, she's brilliant. As It's a great action film. Uh, but I love uh, her calling card as well. I don't want to spoil too much of that, but that's brilliant. But uh, like I say, yeah, so the film goes on and she's... Uh, kind of got a boyfriend kind of thing but she's obviously using an alias name and whatever and uh, something happens which like kind of creates a uh, helpful thing for the police to try and find her but uh, obviously I'm not going to say how that finishes up but yeah it's just really good enjoy it for what it is it's a great action film uh, but yeah definitely want to watch on the big screen if if you can't watch on the big screen it'd be an awesome blu-ray release I'm sure in a lot of years time this will be looked back at on as a uh, great horror film so yeah thanks a lot for watching